get this. The Brabus Invicto Mission, which is based on the Mercedes-Benz G500, costs a more than shocking 665,000 euros. So about $800,000. And it's not even the most expensive car in the Brabus lineup. So why are Brabus vehicles so outrageously expensive? In this video, we'll look at eight reasons why. Stick around to the end to see the vintage car that Brabus restored for $2 million. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on more amazing, so expensive videos. Let's get cracking. Only a few were made. So you hear about Brabus all the time, right? They have a reputation for giving all kinds of vehicles the power, the majesty, and luxury needed to enable them to impress all comers. But that's not what we're really focusing on here. Instead, let's face the fact that the main reason why automobiles made by Brabus are so expensive is that only a few are made each year. Yeah, they're not mass produced, and there's not many of them out there, with each personalized to the maximum, in accordance to the wishes, tastes, and personal proclivities of the would-be owner. Shocking, right? As an example, both the Brabus Rocket 900 and the Brabus GV12 900 are made in 10 iterations each. That assures exclusivity, meaning that if you do get your hands on a Brabus automobile, you can cheerfully boast of driving one of the rarest cars around that onlookers can only see and touch and most likely never be able to afford. Let's take a break here for the quiz. Who founded Brabus? Was it A, Noah Brabus, B, Bodo Bushman, C, Alex Flynn, or D, Wilhelm Maybach? Take a big guess in the comments below right now and stick around to the end of the video to find out if you were correct as we reveal the answer. Incredible personalization options. The second reason why Brabus vehicles cost so much is that they come with the most extensive array of personalization options known to mankind. Regardless of how you want your vehicle to look, sound, or perform, Brabus is down for that and has a reputation of delivering to the limit and beyond. So if you want your vehicle made of solid 18 karat gold, or you want the interior to look like the personal palace of an avowed sybarite who just inherited a diamond mine, well, Brabus can make that possible, so long as you're willing to pay whatever it asked for. Similarly, if you need a rolling office that's more comfortable than a cushion at the right hand of the Almighty, or a supercar with more power to it than a tornado with anger issues, Brabus is more than willing to make that happen. There's almost nothing they can't do, and almost no length they won't go. They'll even armor your car with their Invicto VR6 Plus ERV program. Tell them your dream car and they'll make it into a reality. One caveat though, your car must be a Mercedes-Benz, a smart car, or a Maybach, as Brabus only specializes in these three brands. The quality. The third reason why Brabus automobiles cost what they do is simply because they're made of the highest standard of automobile excellence. No vehicle leaves their factory without passing through stringent tests that other automobile manufacturers balk at and each is attended to by very qualified experts who are exceedingly good at what they do and very experienced too. Even better, all Brabus vehicles make use of the best components such as carbon fiber, platinum edition forged wheels, a limitless variety of leather and Alcantara varieties for the interior, and these are certainly not cheap. Some Brabus cars are also endowed with what's called the Brabus Starry Sky Headliner. This Starry Sky Headliner lights up with hundreds of stars that beautifully change color in sync with the ambient lighting in the car. Given the extent of the attention to detail that Brabus devotes to each of their vehicles, it's more than understandable that they cost what they do. They have since gained a well-deserved reputation for delivering quality workmanship and crafting the kind of vehicles that the angels on high would be most delighted to possess. The additional power. Another reason why Brabus vehicles are so expensive is that they have power. Lots of that, in fact. Now, when Brabus get their hands on a car, they set about improving in all aspects. They make the interior the most luxurious and impressive it can be, and then they set about tuning the engine and adding modifications that give it nearly unimaginable amounts of power and torque. The Brabus Rocket 900, for example, has a 900 horsepower V8 engine that makes it possible for the automotive work of art to reach 100 kilometers an hour in 2.8 seconds, and 300 kilometers an hour in 23.9 seconds. That's absurdly fast for a four-door coupe. There's no comparing a standard vehicle with a Brabus automobile of the same model, because the latter is invariably faster, smoother, and potent in just about every way. People who fork over the cash for a Brabus do so in expectation of getting their hands on a vehicle that can almost outrun anything else merrily rolling down the highway, based on pricey cars. And so we come to the fifth reason why Brabus vehicles are so expensive. 
It might seem kind of ludicrous, but part of the reason why Brabus vehicles are so highly priced is that they're based on cars that are in themselves pricey. For instance, the Brabus 850 is based on the $135,000 Mercedes AMG GLS 63 4Matic, while the Brabus 800 is based on the $150,000 Mercedes AMG S63. They are a status symbol. The sixth reason why Brabus automobiles are so expensive is they're a status symbol for the rich and famous. There's a certain cachet in having one because you will automatically be seen as being rich and having better taste than your peers. Brabus vehicles routinely show up in the music video shoots and movies driven by flashy rappers and evil movie henchmen, and they're the personal chariots of celebrities like mm, Drake. It's generally accepted that you get yourself one once you have the money and want to announce to the people of your city and the tax man that you have crisp greenbacks in abundance and you're not scared of spending as much as it takes to show off your newfound affluence and influence. They command awe, respect, and attention. The seventh reason why Brabus vehicles are so expensive is that they command awe, respect, and attention. And you can't really do that with something cheap. Now, if you're a shrinking violet, then cars with the Brabus badge are certainly not for you. Every vehicle that Brabus tunes out is meant to draw the attention of all eyes and firmly hold on to this until the next century, if possible. They are usually all black, as imposing as an alien ship, and look spectacular even in the pitch black of night. Brabus vehicles have a way of silently screaming their power and announcing their presence, and whenever they appear, crowds invariably gather. Even those who are not at all knowledgeable about cars will usually find themselves drawn to the Brabus automobile, like a moth to a flame or a kid to an ice cream stand. Yeah, Brabus makes vehicles that command attention, awe, and respect, and there is a price to be paid for that. Now, if you had the cash, how many Brabus vehicles would be taking up space in your garage, and what specific models do you like best? Something like a fun but ludicrously tiny Brabus Ultimate E, or the lightning-fast Brabus Rocket 900? Drop your views in the comment section. Brabus Classic. The last reason that makes Brabus cars so expensive is their classic division. Have a vintage Benz that you want restored to a T? Brabus will do that for you. Brabus prides themselves in a restoration process that caters to the first screw to the last. When you bring in your classic Mercedes-Benz, folks at Brabus will inspect and index all parts, discarding all unserviceable parts in the process. Then they replace all lost and damaged parts with newly manufactured, genuine Mercedes parts. I mean, just look at these restored vintage Benzes. You'd mistake them for new ones. Here's a restored 280 SL Pagoda, a restored 280 SE 3.5 Cabriolet, and even a restored 300 SL Gullwing. This doesn't come cheap. For instance, restoring a Mercedes-Benz 300 SL Roadster, like this one, will cost you over $2 million. And now for the moment you've been waiting for, the quiz answer. Earlier on, we asked you who the founder of Brabus was. If you guessed Bodo Bushman, you're right. Bodo looked high and low for a car customizer who could grasp his vision and requirements but couldn't find one. So he decided to start his own car tuning company. Hungry for more so expensive videos? Click on the playlist to the right to binge watch reasons why cars such as the Bugatti Chiron and the Rolls Royce Phantom are so expensive. We'll see you there.